Hi, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the third, okay? Now keep in mind that the timing is fluid and not every reading is for you, okay? The Eight of Wands came flying out. So the Eight of Wands is a very fast-paced energy. It's messaging. It's triumphant news arriving. Um, good news, typically things happening fast, fast forward movement. Um, oh, another one. Two more fell out. The Devil and the Six of Pentacles. So the Six of Pentacles is about give and take. It's about reciprocation. It's about balance. Um, the devil is toxic, okay? It's a toxic behavior. Uh, temptation. Uh, I wonder if we have some temptation here for somebody maybe tempted to do something. Hmm. Uh, Six of Pentacles is uh, receive somebody wants to receive something they are going to be communicating this is some they're going to be communicating they may this could be aggressive uh they're they want something somebody wants something um could be sex just saying uh that's what came to mind because wands are very passionate and the devil is definitely a you know, it's a lusty energy. Could be money as well. We could have greed here. Okay, somebody's looking. Could be looking for money. Um, gonna do something to receive. So somebody wants to receive something, and in order to receive, obviously they have to give something to receive. Ah, so a message. This is messaging, um, communicating. Mm. It feels like there's something unhealthy here with that devil card. You know, that's like gratification, right? It's instant gratification. But it may not be healthy. Mm. Ooh, Ten of Swords. Ten of Swords is suffering. It's betrayal. Um, news, we have news, okay, there's news, there's, the devil is not healthy, okay, it's an unhealthy situation, whether it's materialism, it's greed, it's lust, it's a toxic bond, it's a codependency, news, I don't know if we have somebody here that is about to receive news of an ending, I mean, this is an ending, it is an ending, um, Two of Pentacles reversed. Somebody is, this is like a fall. Losing ground. Poor decision. A mess. Imbalance. We have somebody here that is, is falling or something like that. This is a fall, it's a loss. Making a poor decision, that is a poor decision overextending themselves, doing too much. Receiving news. Somebody is about to receive some news. Ten of Swords. Ten of Swords is the end, right? It is the end. That's the death of a situation. The death of a toxic, unhealthy situation. It's over. The end. The end. This could be a fallout. It could be a fallout. Somebody may be... Uh, going after what they deserve. The Six of Pentacles is about what you deserve. So somebody may be... Letting something go uh, because they deserve something more. They want something more. They want to receive something more. Maybe they've been in a toxic bond. The toxic bond has ended or it's ending. 
This is fast forward movement, fast paced energy. It's triumphant news. Typically it's good news arriving. Whatever it is, it's news. Ah, nine of wands reverse. Now the nine of wands reverse is a, uh, a challenge. Somebody is facing a challenge. They're about to be challenged or they're accepting a challenge. We may have, we may have somebody here that thought that they were going to get away with something. You know, they propositioned, you know, this is like that situation where it's an indefensible approach. It's like you thought you were going to win and you weren't going to be challenged, but you are going to be challenged. This is a challenger, okay? Um, somebody is facing a challenge. This person sits on a really high horse. They're disagreeable. They thought they were winning, but they're losing. That's the nine of pentacles, or the nine of wands reversed. The end of a very well, the devil, okay? The devil is a demon. This is a demon. This is somebody that is highly egotistical, that wants to win and will do anything to win. It's the end. It's the end of whatever this situation is, or that ten of swords wouldn't be here. Somebody's about, well, there's news that is coming. Um... giving up some sort of battle or losing a battle with the nine of wands reversed you know somebody thought that that you know they had it in the bag but they don't nine of wands reversed being challenged somebody is, is being challenged okay they're accepting a challenge they may be being taken out of a position as well or they're changing their position page of wands so the page of wands is somebody that takes risk somebody that is, is taking uh, uh, some sort of approach this is a messenger okay this is a messenger this is somebody that is typically pretty fearless that gets some sort of vision or decides to do something um, what's the, the news spreading the news spreading the news so something about spreading the news um, good news this is good news this is good news somebody's gonna receive some good news this is good news it's, it's, it's an offer or an invite or information or whatever it is this is good news. Going in a new direction. This is exciting. We have an exciting new path opening up. Somebody is giving up on a toxic bond. They may have been avoiding the challenge, but now they're facing the challenge. The end, the end, the end. Somebody was struggling with the choice with that two of pentacles reversed. And it's like they were juggling. They were going back and forth trying to decide. I feel like this is like letting something go. They've overcommitted themselves. They're letting something go to have balance. Both these cards of balance are both about balance. So somebody is, is letting something go to have balance in their life. Um, here's a mess. Whatever. Anyhow, um, judgment definitely the end okay judgment is the end of things it's a life-changing decision it is a revelation there's also some sort of consequences here because when i see the judgment card i think of consequences i think of absolution right it's the end it's it's being held accountable making a life-changing decision a life-changing decision is definitely being made this is the end of a trial it's the end um this is a chance at a new life somebody is is releasing the past the judgment is about the past okay they're releasing the past they're ready they're ready for a new life um judgment the end of things a wake-up call 
there is going to be some sort of announcement. This is good news, whatever the announcement is. The end of indecision. Somebody's been going to extremes. It's over. The juggling is over. The indecision is over. The final decision. This is final. The, the judgment is the final. It's finally over. Finally. Finally over. Something is finally over. This is exciting. The Page of Wands is an exciting new direction. And this is maybe acceptance because judgment can be acceptance. Like accepting, accepting that something is over. Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, looks like she's very solid. She's holding on to something. She's holding on to her value. She's holding on to some sort of opportunity. Money, maybe. Um, Queen of Pentacles, she's very down to earth, laid back. She's sitting there holding on to something. It feels like she's about to receive because of that Six of Pentacles. There's been some sort of indecision. This Queen of Pentacles, is. this is somebody who is very, looks like she's very patient. She's sitting there waiting. She has a golden opportunity in her hands. Okay, she has the, I don't know if it's the gold. I keep, this, that's the golden opportunity. This, maybe she's manifested something. And this could be a she or a he. I'm saying she because that's what's on the card. It doesn't matter what sign you are. There's been some sort of, imbalance but somebody is about to receive and it could be money or a payout or just good news somebody is about to receive something it could be some sort of recognition there's about to be an announcement um somebody there is about to be some sort of announcement the end of a toxic bond the end of a codependent situation a life-changing decision is being made. A generous offer is coming. Somebody is, is going to be making a generous offer of some sort. There's been some sort of indecision, but it's over. The indecision is over. Somebody was juggling. I feel like now this is it. This is it. This is the, this is the, the, the life-changing decision, right? Um... I wonder if for some of you there could be a reconciliation or forgiveness here. Somebody may be asking for a chance or asking for forgiveness. Maybe maybe they didn't see something clearly. I'm just being honest. You know, if maybe somebody was betrayed, this is karma. This is betrayal. Sometimes, you know, that's what wakes people up is a betrayal. And this is awakening. This is an epiphany. So I wonder if somebody's gotten some sort of epiphany. Um, they made a poor choice. They made a poor decision. Now they want to receive. There's messages that are coming. Somebody wants to receive. They want to receive reciprocation. They, they've been betrayed. You know, they've been challenged. They've been avoiding challenge. Now they're facing the challenge. Somebody is ready. They're ready to live. They're ready to uh, have something solid, stable, secure in their lives. This is solid, stable, and secure. Long-term potential. Queen of Pentacles, she's all about stability and, and long-term and commitment. You know, she's a hard worker. She's down to earth. She's patient. She's She knows her value, um, he or she. So this is somebody that is sitting there. It looks like she's just sitting there waiting. She's holding on to what she has. Somebody wants a chance. Somebody wants this person to give them a chance. They may want forgiveness. Judgment can be a card of forgiveness. Somebody's also about to be judged. I feel like somebody's about to be, or somebody is, is judging somebody on their behavior. But this Queen of Pentacles looks like she's, she's about to receive. You see, she's about to receive something. Mm.
Whatever it is, this is exciting. This could be a new suitor. The Page of Wands can be a new suitor, suitor bursting into your world. It can, whatever it is, it's good news. It's an offer or an invite. Somebody that is taking a risk. You know, they're facing a challenge. This is somebody that wants to be given a chance. You know, um, there is definitely some sort of communication coming with that Eight of Wands or news, news of. You know, there could be. You know, sometimes news is good news. That's good news to you and not another person. You know, we do have a unhealthy bond here with the Devil card. Could be dealing with the Capricorn. We also have Scorpio, of Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius as well. Somebody, somebody is, is about. I feel like we have somebody here that is ready to face any challenges because they want to receive. They have not been receiving. They have not been receiving. They've been in a toxic bond. Maybe it was a trauma bond. Now it's like, you know, I'm ready for a new life. I'm ready for something solid. I'm ready for something stable. You know, when you when you decide to end the toxic bond, that's when the the new comes in. Okay, so there is definitely something new here. Judgment is the end of things. The Empress, the Empress. Now, the Empress is the goddess of love. We had her yesterday, and, and that makes sense that she would come up today, okay? So she's it's a, it's a very fertile time. This is the birth of a new life, right? This is a rebirth. This is beautiful. This is absolutely beautiful. This is giving birth to a new life. It's time for a delivery. It's time for a blessing. Somebody's about to receive a blessing. There, This is abundance, okay? Somebody is about to receive, okay? This is the end of some sort of suffering, okay? This is the end of suffering, the end of pain, the end of a toxic bond. Uh, letting go of something that has been causing an imbalance, making a life-changing decision brings new life, right? This empress, she, she gives birth to new life. She nurtures things, um... It looks like it's harvest time in some way. This is the goddess of health, wealth, and abundance, and love, okay? So, my nose is itching. Just started itching. So, yeah, the, this is like... Well, we definitely have somebody here that is a natural. This person is a natural. They're a creator. They're creating something. So we have a creator here that I feel like is about to receive some sort of offer. Okay? This is an offer or an increase, a generous offer from somebody that is wealthy maybe or has money or something like that. Somebody's about to see, they're about to receive a blessing of some sort. There's a mother here as well. This is like a mother. I mean, the Queen of Pentacles and the Empress are a mother. Very down to earth, laid back, uh, comfortable. Unconditional love. Something about unconditional love tender loving care somebody's gonna do something because they want some love they want to be abundant they want it they want it and I feel like they've been indecisive they've been in an unhealthy bond but it's over it's over this is the Empress she knows her value so this is the Queen of Value okay the Queen of Pentacles and the Empress this is the Queen of Value this is about value this is about my value this is about what I'm worth I have a lot to offer so I feel like there is somebody here that is going to be giving something to this person because they want to receive. Uh, Six of Swords is going to a better place. It's moving on. It's leaving a troubled situation behind. This is the rite of passage. It is a time of transition. So we do have somebody here that is going through a transitional phase. Um... They're leaving behind a situation that has been turbulent and rocky and there's been a lot of 
um, battling, there's been a lot of fighting, there's been a lot of conflict, there's been a lot of power struggles, probably hostilities. That's It's like severing ties, going to that better place, moving on, um, headed towards peace and serenity and tender loving care. So whatever was going on here, we do have uh, the end of suffering. The end of suffering, um, this is the end of suffering, the end of a painful, toxic bond. This is a blessing, this is a new life. Both of these cards are new life. This is a new life, this is beautiful. It's nurturing, it's solid, it's stable, it's gonna grow. Somebody is in the process of ending a phase and, and beginning a new one that is absolutely filled with love. Um, there's an offer or an invite that is coming. Um, it may be a work offer. I'm not sure. It could also be a relationship offer. Um, whatever is coming, there is an offer or an invite that is coming. There will be a need to... Uh, obviously make a choice with that Two of Pentacles. You know, maybe take a, take a step. You know, there's a need to take a step. Maybe let go of fears. I don't know. Um... Somebody is receiving an offer or they have an opportunity for long-term stability here. They do. But they, they, and this is like, they have to uh, make that decision. You have to make that decision. So somebody is about to make a big life-changing decision. Good luck. <laughs>